Hey y'all, namaste. Kasak Ma Keparu here. Haru Nefer. Assalamu alaikum. Well, I'm here in this protest. And as you can see around me, it's being that uh, it's a, a pro-Palestine um, protest. And the one thing I want to say about this is that um, I'm never opposed to a peaceful protest. But I want you to understand that they're very um, powerful forces out there that cannot be overcome through physical means. And I'm not saying I'm for one side or for another side, but what I'm telling you is that when you start to protest in this manner, what you're doing is you're giving up your power. You have to understand that you're God man, God woman. And as an infinite being with all power, you have the potential to shift to an alternate reality where what you want can manifest as long as you're aligning your vibration to that which you desire most, which you're most excited about. Now, we're brought up in this Western society or this corrupt world, this uh, polarizing left brain thinking, which basically tells you that you have to subscribe to Cartesian logic, which means that basically if you want to change something, you have to have direct action. There has to be a one-to-one -one correlation. Well, many times things that you want to change in life, you must take an indirect route to it. And in, in that way, what I mean is that the power that you have within you resides in your subconscious mind. And all you have to do is turn inward through trans state induction. And again, as I said before, align your vibration to that which you most want and watch the change, watch the wonderful manifestation, or the other alternative, you can just be out here like these individuals are, and protest, which tells the right brain that you're powerless, that you're not God, man, God, God, woman, that you're human. And you can beg your government for change, and as I said, you're dealing with some very sinister and corrupt forces, so more than likely, they're not going to change because they have an agenda, and their agenda uh, reaches far in the future. They've got probably a 20-year plan of the way they want to see in which the world is going to unfold, so they're just enacting their plan. And you're going through the emotions of protesting will do little to change the way they think. Rather, um, as Michael Jackson said, start with the man in the mirror. Look at yourself and say, what is my vibration? So I would look at it from that perspective. And as I said in previous videos, when we had the Trump and Hillary election, that some of us um, moved and shifted to a parallel reality where Trump is present, and some of us shifted to where uh, an another Earth where Hillary is present right now at this present moment. So where are you going to shift? What's your highest vibration? So oh, she's smiling at me. <laughs> What's your highest vibration? Why not go there? and recognize who you truly are and use the power within you. So if you like this video, hit the like button. Subscribe to my channel for more videos about how to empower yourself. Until my next broadcast, this is Gisak Ma'a son of Ma'at, and uh, that's all for now. Amin Ra.